Hi, my name is Avinash, and I'm the author of the books Web Analytics 2.0 and Web Analytics in our day. I'm very excited to present this webinar about Web Analytics to all of you. Um, in this uh, particular video, I want to cover the, the incredible opportunity that exists in using data online in solving key business problems, um, as well as outline for you some of the more specific things that you can do once you do start using web analytics and sort of aspirationally all of the other more wonderful things that are over the horizon that you'll be able to take advantage of once you start creating a truly data-driven business. Now, why would you want to do web analytics? A lot of people ask me this question, and honestly, it surprises me because if you're not wanting deeply, profoundly desiring to be data-driven, then really there is no honest way to survive in the world that we live in today as all different channels come together and online continues to dominate growth for companies and growth for nonprofits, as a matter of fact. But let me crystallize why you should invest in web analytics in a very simple way. When you take out an ad in a magazine and try and measure its success, in this case, an ad for Chevy Malibu, all of the measures for success are interpretive or proxy driven. For example, you take out an ad in the Time magazine and the best proxy you have for measuring success is the number of subscribers the magazine has. You have absolutely no idea how many people might have opened the magazine, how many people might have bothered to even see your gorgeous little ad, and, and much less you would know how many people then went to a dealership and might have purchased uh, the product that you're selling in this magazine ad. But, but if you think about it, when you take out that exact same ad, in this case on Google, or Yahoo, or Microsoft, or AOL, or, or any other property in the world, the ad that shows up right here at the very top does not require you to use your faith to measure success. You can use data to measure success because you can measure exactly how many people saw the ad, you can measure how many people clicked on the ad, how many people interacted with the ad, and finally, if people do come to your website as a result of this ad, you're able to measure how many people customize a car, set up a appointment at the dealership, downloaded a brochure, and, and all of the outcomes that are available for that single ad that you took. So the measurement of success, rather than being interpretive and proxy driven, is direct, it is specific, and it is scalable. And I cannot think of a better, more powerful and profound reason for you to use web analytics than that it moves you away from making business decision based on faith and what you believe even to shifting to using data and bringing a massive amount of accountability to the processes that you're executing for your business.